English got a coup, English got a coup, invasion moves, read all about it. English got a coup, English got a coup, invasion moves, read all about it. Oh, I say, what is that noise? What's that? <laughs> what the? What's this? Some kind of earthquake? in line. They'll be having delays on that for the next hundred years. <laughs> Kill them! Kill them all! God's teeth, boy! Kid, I'm an American. Old Billy Fisk is gonna go get some payback. Yeah! What? A time and shall have to wait? It is time for action. Sir, no, your place is here. We can't risk losing you. You must stay in the bunker. We have no army left. Who else is going to defend Ironing Street? We still have Major Rupee and his brave Punjabi guards. I guarantee they will stand and fight. Brave men of the Punjab, we are the last of the remaining empire. The only soldiers England has left. Their army has surrendered, helpless on the shores of Dunkirk. So now this honor has been bestowed on us. Us, the men of the Raj. And when the time comes, we will all do our duty for England and protect Churchill Sahib at all costs. What in the name? Bloody Billy Fisk. Well, if it ain't Major Rupee and his pack of engines. You mean to tell me that out of the whole bloody Royal Air Force, the only pilot to survive the Battle of Britain was... An American! That's right, hot dog. Morning, boys. I suppose you have come to pay me that 50 American dollars you owe me? No. Nope. Wally got shot out of my pants this morning. Your 50 bucks is somewhere over France now, buddy. I might have known. That is the last time I play poker with some half-wit, two-bit crop duster pilot. Oh, yeah? Pal, half the Soviet army's around that corner. You mean German? They're gonna roll their tanks up this street like shit through a goose. So quit your jabbering and saddle up. Lock and load, guys. Make ready, men. Hey, pal, it's time to take a hike. No, no, I nearly need it. Crazy-ass Polak. Okay, Rube, let's light the candles. Goodbrah! Light the invasion beacon! They're on their way! Yes, 
टेस्ट में जा नाइट द बीगन इट्स द बीगन एट व्हाइट हॉल लाइट द बीगन What's that? Blind me! It's the beacon of Crystal Palace. Fire the beacon, lads! It's the invasion! The beacon of Croydon's been lit, sir. Beacon at Maidstone. They've come. It's the invasion. Look. Light the beacon, Albert. Back to the village, lads. There ain't much time. Sacre bleu! Take up your positions, man. Come on, you guys. Get that MG moving. We got ourselves a war to win. All right. Army assholes! It's time to hammer down the circle. Got it. I've got it. Quiet, quiet. It's the news. This is the BBC Home Service. Here is the news at 12 o'clock. The German army has invaded London. <gasps> I repeat, the German army has invaded London. London? I don't believe it. Why can't they stay in their own country? The Prime Minister will now make a speech from the Cabinet War Rooms. My dear countrymen, my dear friends, never in the field of human conflict was so much buggered up by so few for so many. What's wrong with it? Charming calling, charming calling. Hello, Englanders. This is the voice of the Nazis. The whole of the BBC are now dead. We have successfully invaded your capital city of London. We are ready to capture your beloved Prime Minister, Herr Winston Churchill from Downing Street. Oh yeah. Oh, we have a very special message for. Do not hide. We will find you. You are as good as captured, fat boy. No one can escape us. And that is all I have to say on the matter. Apart from my elite Punjabi guards, we have absolutely no military defence whatsoever. Therefore, I ask any of you who are in any way able to come to our aid, do do so immediately. We're back. And I give the order: we should retreat to. We should we retreat to Monday? How the hell should I know? Retreat to. Uh, retreat to. Land. The land of the Scots? Sir! The Scots are hordes of murderous, blood drinking savages! Retreat to Scott Land. Head north to Hadrian's Wall. Good luck and God save us all. Scott Land? Hadrian's Wall? Surrender seems to be our only option. You hear that? They're talking about surrender. We've never been to London. Where is it? Let's go back to the pub. Father, they're leaving. Stay and fight. Be more like the foreigner. Like who? The foreigner. Him. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Uzi, found him down on the beach. <laughs> la guerre. Je vive pour la guerre. <laughs> Resistance fighter, no doubt. Tu dis qu'on le voit. Je m'appelle Gaston Laurent. Je suis français. Ah, ça, t'es un mafou. 
You'll have no homes left to go back to. What's wrong with you all? Chris? Have you forgotten what being English means? It means being free. I might just be a simple farm boy, but at least I'm a free simple farm boy. What does freedom mean to you? Freedom to grow your own crops and graze livestock. Think what they'll do to your farms. Your cows, Farmer Gray. Your pigs, Mr. and Mrs. Sparrow. I got a ferret. Think what will happen to your fanny matron, Rutty. Join me so that in future years you can proudly say, I fought for England. Now who is with me? <laughs> We got no guns. He's right, Christopher. We used up all our weapons against that zeppelin. Pas de problème. Merde. All right, you fuckers. Arm yourselves. Wow, Chris, when did you get so tough? Whew, I like it. The army won't be able to hold out for long. We need to get to London. It's not far. We can make it if we move now. Don't be bloody ridiculous, boy. How do you propose we get there? On old Betty. Bastard. TNT, up the line. I am coming, Sahib. Pack as much TNT into the barricades as you can. These firecrackers will bust their German bottoms right back to Berlin. <laughs> Just keep your big hands off my daughter, boy.